There are so many challenges that go unseen when it comes to having kids on the spectrum who appear to have lower support needs or be higher functioning. I don't like that term. But take this doorknob for example, which was at one point very securely attached to this door. My son has to be pushing down on something whenever he's communicating to help him regulate. And he pushes down on so many things that they often break, like this doorknob. Or this bookshelf, which at one point had doors, but we had to take them off because anytime he stood around it, he pushed on the doors so strongly that they started pulling the bookshelf apart. And our poor feet. Whenever he's communicating with us, if he can't be pushing down on a surface, he steps on our toes. So it's so frustrating when other people in his life, like teachers at his school, overlook these types of concerns because they don't come through in testing or he's doing well enough. He's doing well enough for you because he's masking all day. And then he comes home and he has so much sensory regulation to do that he unintentionally breaks things like doorknobs. There are so many challenges.